What up, Jake Paulers? Breadman here. Every video, my intros get worse. They just get worse and worse. So the other day, I was just vibing, you know, hanging out at the local pool, and then I fucking died. The end. I'm so angry! I'm so angry. I'm fucking degenerate. Well shit, boys, I don't know what to make a video on. Hmm. I know. Let's use the wheel of content. Oh. Fat woman breaks scale. Well hey, this is my biggest achievement so far. My sub count is very close to... the, f the, the person who broke the scale. This is my gr greatest achievement thus far. If, if we get like five new subscribers, we will have surpassed them, which would be an epic. The destruction of this scale is dedicated to all of the women whose lives have been ruined and ruled by it. This is for us, ladies. Safety first. Yeah, um, I'm fairly certain you probably don't need goggles for that. I'm tired of you stealing my life. I'm tired of you making me feel if I'm good or bad. I'm tired of you deciding. Bruh, the poor scale, it had a family. This is just outrageous. Scale lives matter, everyone. Scale lives matter. Please stop. Please stop. You are hurting me. Please, God. I don't want to die. Please. I have a family, I have a wife, and five kids. Little Harold is still a fetus. What kind of god would allow something so cruel? I've been stepped on, and now I'm getting a sledgehammer. Goodbye, Susan, baby. I love you. I'm a bad nag, you! I deserve a great life! This is about me! This isn't about you! Oh my god, that's like better than sex. That's like better than sex. Bruh, you literally just destroyed the life of a family man. And then you have the nerve to say, this is better than sex. Just shame on you, 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 you destroyed a, the life of a family man. And now an entire family is going to be devastated. Think about what you've done, sit in the corner and never touch my scale, son, again, or we will call the cops. You're a, you're a discriminatory person who doesn't stand for scale rights. Also, whenever I use my scale, it doesn't work and it just says E. So I'd imagine the scale was probably already damaged. Bruh, don't be fat shaming women, you fucking straight white male sexist pig. Fuck you. Listen. I'm fat too. Okay, well that video is a little bit too short to make this video kind of worthwhile, so let's spin the wheel again. Oh god, it's Hey Science. Not another feminist slam poetry. This gives me flashbacks of... Oh god. Oh god. No. Never again. Never again. Well, before we watch that video, to all of my male viewers, I suggest you cut off your penis so that way you won't be seen as sexist. I don't have to though, because it's small. It's after an article on the Daily Beast, which was titled, Was 2014 the year science discovered the female orgasm? Man, don't you just love that 2011 Windows Movie Maker transition? And it's not very often that I agree with a radical feminist, but that news article's title is just straight up retarded. Like, come on, 2014? Really? I'd imagine it probably would have been, you know, discovered back when... You know, Neanderthals. No, no, not even Neanderthals. Homo erectus. No, no, no. Not, not probably not even that. Like what, whatever became, whatever came before Australopithecus. I'm a nerd. I need to stop talking. Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey, science! <laughs> I take back everything I said. You know what? I'm just going to agree with the newspaper. I'll just, 
I don't care what was in it. I know the title's just brain damage, but like, yeah, no, 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 none of this, please. I'd rather put all of the audio in one ear than listen to the yelling slash screaming in this video. You invented the microwave 60 years ago so you could cook your hungry man steak dinners, and you're just now getting around to my body. Again, sorry to be a nerd yet again, but if I remember correctly, the microwave was actually invented by accident. I don't remember how or whatever, but... And also, that's kind of sexist to say only men eat steak dinner. Thanks, science! I just graduated college and my sexuality is finally validated! I've been coming since 2004, and now... Yeah, 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 no, 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 too much information. Huh, <laughs> gay quirky, lol. Thanks, science, for pretending I haven't been fucking myself the right way since 2004! You look like an iCarly extra. <laughs> hey, science! Since it's 2015, are you now accepting women's opinions on the subject at hand? I accept opinions, at least. Hey, science! When she says, hey, science, it looks like a demon just escaped from her soul. Idiot! How about you start hiring women instead of quoting Freud and calling it science? You take my word for it and put your energy towards more productive things, like hey science! How about you invent a dildo that turns into a whisk so I can bake a cake afterwards? <laughs> or how about a dishwasher sink dildo? One that is safe for me and also washes my dishes. Also, a taser? What the fuck? A taser. Okay. I mean, okay, okay, if you're into, like, electric shit or whatever, okay. You do you. Just... That sounds painful. Sounds very, very painful. See, I think I'm about done with this video. Let's hope the, um, the wheel of content gives us some better, better choices next time. So, let's go with what today's deal is. If you leave a like and sub, you'll die. But also, I will send each and every one of you your very own feminist. It won't do much. We'll probably just stand there and call you a sexist. Maybe scream at you for manspreading. So hope you enjoy your own feminist. Have a good day, lads. See you in the next video. It will probably either be a video like this or one of a new series I'm going to make, so stay tuned for that, and yeah, have a good day. Bye.